Hey all, welcome back. We've got some EU4 going. We are beating up at Spain. Gonna expand our vassal Aragon. Uh, let's see here. You take that. Siege of Castilla La Vea. Okay. Let's diplomacy. No, that's what I want to do. Province. Failure. Um let's give that to you as well. Let's see here, you. Down there, that's good. Keep on expanding. Expanding is worth it. Yeah, we're losing ships. They're being picked off slightly, but that's fine. We'll build more. We've got money. I'm less worried about it. Madrid! Let's deal with these rebels, because that's no they're annoying. I assume, yeah, there's like all sorts of random stuff going on that way. Um how much do I care about it? Um, I could do stuff over here. I'm not sure that I care. Let's go siege that for the hell of it. Cold England, you need to build some freaking castles. It would help you. Do that. Actually, you know what? Go deal with that first. Um, more conversions, which is good. Diplotech, still one more turn. So let's do like one more culture conversion, maybe two. We'll start that one. And then we should be good. We can do a for religion on you. You come back over here and siege that for me. Yeah, if you guys had any military, it would really help you. Like, just don't have any local military, and I can run through you because of it. Zob is much bigger. He shows promise. We've got a new general. That's cool. Um, in fact, let's give you that new general. Go siege things for me. Get this to Aragon. We're going to expand Aragon. <laughs> That's what we've decided. Um, let's do that there. Get you. There we go. There. Not occupied by me. Occupied by Eric. Um, and then we may. Can we have the point where we can do our new tech? No. Next year. Alright. Kunika has been done. Spaniards appear to want to try to fight against me, which is cute. Um, let's just do that. Let's go take the castles that are left. So we can not worry about having to, to siege them to keep things on sieging, etc. Uh, the forts, not castles. I just want to call them fort castles. <laughs> um, couldn't care less. This is fine. Let's move you down here then. Now let's take this one and split this in half. Go deal with you up there because you're annoying. Move this one over here and then we'll deal with the rest. We won that already. Okay. So you go deal with that. make Aragon any happier of us. Um, you go there. You come down here. Keep on sieging. Portugal is strong. Oh! Whoops. Yes, yeah, these guys are having a field day. That's fine. siege down these so they can stop spawning troops. It's really the biggest issue. Occupied by Morocco. I guess Morocco's in this war too. Want 
this army. There we go. I did move it. I was like, why isn't it moving? Uh, did eventually decide to move you. I do like that we just like let Cold England get wiped every time. So we've not bothered to station more troops down there. Oops. Come down here. So you can see just that. Well, wow. don't know why those light ships were moving. It's kind of annoying. Salamanca. Spain is basically siege at this point. By basically siege, I mean entirely sieged. Wow. Um, Portugal, do you want to make some peace with me? You just take a white piece. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get rid of you. Yeah, because that also gets rid of, I think, all of their allies, which was annoying. Now I can just deal with Spain, which is actually fine. Let's see here. Diplomacy. Sue for peace. I want to give you all of these. Um, wow. All your money. You have a decent amount. War rep. Um, do that. That. Can't say both of your subjects. Let's have you release a nation or two. Um, release Sar Sardinia. That seems good because they're annoying anyway. Um, Yeah, let's do that. Just wreck Spain as much as possible. Send demand. So Aragon is now much bigger. Um, and they're about the size now where we want to, like, consider um, integrating them. Oops, let's hit the button. Influence and Exfassel. Yeah, let's start that now. Take a lot of depot power, but it's okay. We'll send. Take you. We will pick this up, and we will pick that up, which is perfect. Um, we have too few rivals because we wiped out Spain. Okay. Netherlands can be a rival for me. I'm fine with that. You. We can convert there. That's good. Let's get our troops all back to home. Should be making a ton of money. We should also hopefully be gaining manpower soon. We are. Perfect. Um, hmm. Mercs. There are still mercs somewhere. How are there mercs? Um, <laughs> let's see here. You, your light ship. Let's go have you go protect trade somewhere. Um, your heavies? Yes, you are. Let's move you down there. Protect trade somewhere, please. Let's do this. All of you merge together and mothball you. Save some more money. Um, what's this set doing? You're all galleons. Well, you're heavies too. Let's upgrade you first. No, let's upgrade you. And then we'll mothball you. Uh, military access from Netherlands is no longer a rival, f valid rival for me. It's fine. Let's worry. Let's boost our stability two more and get rid of this damn disaster. It's fine. I'll start military leader, which was James Churchill. Churchill's dead. Sorry, guys. Kind of feel bad, but I don't. Um, make a long-term investment. We'll gain a ton of money. Do a long-term investment, that's fine. Military access, that's good. 
I can just mothball you now. Because, yeah, that makes sense. Alright. So one more boost here. We'll get rid of the damn disaster. And go back to planning things. To lose. Who are you allied with? Anyone that I care about? Portugal. If I go to war with you, what happens? They all come in. Alright. If I go to war with Luxembourg, what happens? Everyone with their mother comes in. What about Netherlands? Austria, Brandenburg, Poland. Poland is scary. Um, Switzerland, declare war. Nuremberg, Tria, Saxony. Austria. Maybe time to beat up on Austria some. Try to knock them back since they're the, they're the emperor. Um, I have high fervor. Okay. That's good. Let's do it for trade. Um, I think that's worth it. We'll boost our stability again, which should get rid of this. There we go. We're actually still making positive here, but I don't need more stability. I wish I could figure out... Oh, the positive stability gives us that, too. All right, that's what's happening. Um, that makes sense now. Now, let's see here. We are... Build a bunch more ships. Let's build some... Let's build... What, I can build two... One, two, three, and then... Lights, let's do one... Two, and that should get close to maxing us. Probably not quite there. I think I just did not mentally make that make sense, but it's okay. It really wants me to vassalize Scotland because it thinks that I'm like over here with Scotland. Um, Iroquois, there's just you left. That's fine. I have colonists. I could be colonizing things, but eh. More mercenary maintenance. Yep, that's fine. Alright, let's do this. Since we're at max, let's do some stability as well. Might as well. Just for the fun of it. We're now 100% where we want to be. We will definitely Royal Mary our vassal that we're integrating anyway. Um. Oh, our opinion of them is negative 35. Interesting. Well, can't do anything about that. Or if I can, I don't know what I can do, so I won't worry about, worry about it. Let's move singletons over here. Keep on building. It's time to build more buildings. Let's do some protection buildings. So I don't think we are finished with those. Yeah, not at all. Um, upgrade all of the production buildings. Do da, do da. Um, literally, like, you can do batches of these things. It's amazing. Um, internal conflicts there. I don't care about. Come now. Um, 90. We get, we are, our income is 90 ducats a month. Alright. Um, money has ceased to be an issue in a large sense. We still have our proper advisors, right? Aachen, we're at max. Okay. We're at plus three all the time. Let's recall that diplomat. Let's also get one out to Cologne, because we haven't really done that yet. Improve relations. Um, we are annexing you. Holding Lind, how do you feel about me? Can I improve relations with you? Yeah, let's do that. Is that all Netherlands? New Netherlands. I was like, what is Netherlands doing over there? All right. I want to go to war with... Let's see here. We can't declare war with you. 
I need to deal with Austria or Bohemia. I think. We're not going to deal with Poland. Also, Bukhara still around. There's a Muscovy, a Russia. <laughs> oh my. Bengal has done quite well for themselves. Persia. I'll we'll just do more points. Japan has expanded mightily. There's been some interesting options here. And the Ottomans have largely been stopped. I suspect that's by Poland more than anything. But I don't really know. More trade efficiency gives us even more money. We are definitely at the point where I should be finding my marks. But let's build some more 16 stacks. We can build at least, what, two more? Yeah. One. Build one up here, too. Two. Um, you have mercs? No. You. Where did those mercs go so I can kill them? Are they you mercs? You are. Let's get rid of all the mercs here. Perfect. All right, so now we have no more mercs. That's good. 95. So let's do another standard 16 up here just for the hell of it. Perfect. Um, what are the light ships doing up here? Let's go have you protect trade somewhere. Um, we all own trade here. Do that. All of the ships. Um, or the troops, really. So, I was not happy about that for a little bit there. Um, whoa! Okay, guys, stop flipping out. An excellent minister. Gain a level 3 statesman who's cheaper. William Pitt the Elder. Awesome. That's kind of cool. He founded the school I went to. I went to, um... And so he, he founded the school that I went to, which I kind of like. Um, protect trade there. Let's see here. Which one is Pitt? I assume he's here. William Pitt the Elder. Better dip rep for, like, half the price. We'll do it. Sounds good to me. I do love that our kings are so bad. We are maxed with cold England. Damn. Let me see. I want to fight you, maybe? We need to figure out who we're going to declare war on. We're going to declare war on someone. We've already beat up on Spain. Let's see here. Austria, Luxembourg, Salzburg, Cleves, Frankfurt. It's not actually horrible. What is Austria's military might at the moment? Military, armies, Austria. 108 with no manpower at the moment. Interesting. So we're at max for our armies, which is good. Um, let's bring you over here, I guess. And you guys can come up there. And you can go over there. There's a singleton ship. What are you doing? Go protect trade somewhere. Yep, you're a protector of trade and failing me. Go general. Um, An advisor, which is annoying. But we'll pick up a inflation reduction, which is potentially more useful than what we have there. Maybe. Luxembourg has a big army. Yeah. All these guys have big armies, which means we're just going to have to like do some awesome battles to win, but I think Luxembourg's the next option. Or maybe it's Toulouse. Um, Algiers and Portugal. How much do I care about Portugal? Um, I mean, they'd come in, they're annoying, they stop my ships and that kind of stuff, so. You know what I need to do? I haven't done recently. Go home at war. Go home at war. Yeah, let's do this. To make sure that we don't get our troops caught out, or not our troops, our ships caught out, um, which is something we do somewhat regularly. So I'd prefer to avoid it, if at all possible. And you know what? That's the end of this episode, looking at our timer. Uh, so we'll call an end here. We, well, Aragon's moving closer and closer to being fully integrated. Um, and then we need to figure out another target. We've got 60 years, so hopefully we can continue into 
sort of Central Europe proper here, um, as well as moving our way down. We'll, we'll deal with Spain as well. But all right, thank you guys very much for watching. Look at Sicily. Can anyone point out Sicily? What the hell happened? <laughs> I have never seen a Sicily that way. Anyway, we'll call it an end. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Bye bye.